Good morning, children. For grade eight, today we are going to revise computer science. In last class, we have discussed some chapters. In this class, we are going to do revision. Okay, children. What is first chapter? MS Access 2010. What is the first chapter? MS Access 2010. That is Microsoft Access 2010. What do we use for MS Access? We can create database using MS Access. What are the topics we have discussed? Database, functions of DBMS, DB objects, creating DB components and data types. What do you mean by database? Using database, we can be able to store the data. That is a large amount of data and we can be able to retrieve the data whenever we want. Then second one, functions of DBMS. What are the functions of DBMS? We can delete, we can also create new databases. DB objects, we have seen what is a DB objects. That is database. Creating database. We can create different type of database. For example, we can be able to create a simple blank database. Or either we can able to create database for contact or for any job related database. We can able to create in the other templates that is available in the MS Access. Then components and data types in the database. So these are the topics we have seen in MS Access 2010. So Access is a database. First topic is true or false. What is the first question? Customize screens to provide an easy way to enter and view data in the table called reports. Customize the screens to provide an easy way to enter and view data in the table called report. Is it a report? No, it is a not a report. So it is a false statement. A new database can be created only using blank database. New database can be created only in blank database. No, we can create using other templates also. So it is also a false statement. When is our price to retract specific information from table? Yes, how we can uh, retrieve the data using queries? For example, I want to retrieve a data from the database. So I, I have to type that student's marks. So that uh, using that query, I can able to retrieve the data. Simply giving students uh, mark in all display the all marks and the students. We have to give the correct uh, table name. For example, student for uh, grade A, student grade A is the table name. We have to uh, give student grade A. Then the what is the column that is student mark. Then I can give the uh, full star. Then I can able to retrieve the data from the database. So it is called as a query. Queries are right. So specific information from the table. So it is a correct statement. So customized means to provide an easy way to enter and view data in the table called reports. No, it is not a report. So it is a false statement. A new database can be created only using blank database. It is also a false statement. Queries are ways to retrieve specific information from the table. It is a correct statement. And so fourth question, what are more database objects are found when a DB is created. Yes, we can able to find what are more well, uh, what are more objects. So, what are more data resources are found when a database is created. It is true. The primary key should always have a value that is not repeated for other record. So, a primary key is a unique key. Unique key means it is only one key for one table. So, the primary key should always have a value that is not repeated for other record. It is also a Correct statements. So, one or more database objects are found when a DB is created, it is a true statement. The primary key should always have a value that is not repeated for other record, it is also a true statement. Okay. Then, next topic is differentiate. We are going to differentiate the any two topics. For example, record and field. What is a record? A record is one row of a table. It includes complete information. A record is one row of a table. It includes complete information. How it com uh, contains all the information in a row? We can able to see, for example, in field the name, roll number, the name, mark, subject. These all will be included in the field name. For a 
something. So field is not an incomplete information. Record means the record is one row of a table. It includes complete information. Field means it is a column arranged vertically in a table. It will be in a vertical means from top to bottom. Horizontal means from left to right. What is the second question? Table and queries. What do you mean by table? It shows information in the form of rows and columns. It shows information in the form of rows and columns. What do you mean by queries? These are used to select the required data from the table. For example, I want to print all the register number of a particular class. I can give a query for that and I can retrieve the retrieving means taking the data from the table. What do you mean by table? It shows information in the form of rows and columns. What are the rows? Rows are from horizontal lines are called rows. That is from left to right. It gives complete information. But column means we also call as fields. So it is from top to bottom. It never gives the complete information. Whereas means these are used to select the required data from the table. If I want to select something, I can select using any query. So if we give in that query, no data will be printed. Then what is the third machine? Data sheet view and design view data sheet. Then what are the data sheet uh, view and design view in the data, uh, data, uh, database? The data sheet is the row and column format is seen in the data sheet view. Where the data can be added. So the row and column format, row and column format is seen in the data sheet view. Where data can be added in the data sheet view. Data, whatever we want. But in design view, descriptions like field name and data type can be added in the design view. In design, descriptions like field name and data type can be added in the design view. Data sheet means the row and column format is seen in the data sheet. So the data sheet view where data can be added. So in the design, descriptions, descriptions means like register number, class is number. So, field names, those we call it as field names. And data types, data types means for name, what we will give? Character, only character will be given for the name. Why? We are giving only letters. Letters are also called as characters. For uh, register number, if I am having register number with numbers and characters, that is letters, what I will give? I will give the data type as varchar. Varchar means that is numbers and letters will be included in the so, that will be seen in the design view. In data sheet view, only the row and column format is seen, but in the design view, we can able to have the field name, that is the description about the field. It also includes the data type. So, if you are giving us number, we will give the data type as num, that is num. If you are giving the character letter, we will give the data type as can. If we are giving both number and letter, I will give the data type as character in a database. Okay. We will answer the following. What is the first question? What is the DBMS? Discuss its function. What is the DBMS? What is, what is the expression for DBMS? Database management system. Discuss its function. What are the uses of it? Let us see. Database refers to the arrangement of data in a manner where it can be Database refers to the arrangement of data. Arrangement of data means data 
Okay, guys.